What's up, guys? Robert Julia alongside with Flair. What's good, Flair? I'm tired. Shout out to I'm So Angry, by the way. OD. OD. And we also got Alexis with her coffee. Oh, T. She don't drink. And we got my man G Money over there. Look at that. He's focusing, fixing up on his neck cross. Anyway, we, <laughs> we are also over here with Jackson. Huh? Yeah, Jackson. <laughs> He's getting a nice suit. <laughs> anyway, what's up, Jackson? What you got for us? They got subterfuge. Subterfuge. That's guru control. That's two different versions. You got guru control, and then you got subterfuge. Subterfuge is actually playing all the guys. Guru control is like, I play two of the guys in that team. There's this full subterfuge. I'm looking for a huge amount of guys. Not guru control. Ish. Yeah. Are you happy you got guru, though? I am. So let's get straight to it, bro. I'm hyped. Let's see what right. we got here. So for people who know Subter, I'm just gonna show you the monsters I play. Skip the effects. Okay. So I play one of each: Behemoth, the mm -hmm. the Bomb Man, right? Bust. One of them. One of them. One of them. One of everything. One of everything. I'm starting to realize there's a lot of Subterras. You got all the Behemoth. You play one. I play one of each because depending on the scenario is what you bring out for that. That all scenario, I guess. Makes sense. Makes sense. Okay. Uh, the the goo. The goo. They came out. I played three of them things because three of them things. Three of them things. He's amazing. Oh. Okay. Okay. He does almost everything except you know cook for you. <laughs> you flip him and some something else, right? Yep. On the board. You mean your old gods or whatever? If you have enough stuff to card, the cook effect, book face down. Uh, and you add a sub to a car when you face up. He's amazing. I'm, I'm glad that he, he's, he's finally out. I play one of him. He still has his uses because I have to chain block against these guys. So you go chain like one, chain two, chain block your opponent to try to hit your main guy. You want these guys on board. He's your main guy. He's either your, your beaters, your go to guy. I play the one archer. I play three Phoenix, the best hand trap in the game. Don't, know, don't let no one else tell you otherwise. Just shuts down. Only for the deck, bro. Only for the deck. But this right here says, I am God, and I say no to oh, your activation or effect. I play three ass, standard. The real best hand trap. I don't know about that. <laughs> this is what I play for monsters, my monster lineup. All right. Not bad, not bad, okay. For the spells, I pay one Cave Cash, one Cave Clash, this card is amazing. Okay. It gives all your guys buffs, and for each monster on the board is face down, and during the damage, you can add a sub to your card, except itself from the, from the grave to your hand. Okay. I pay one right, uh, monster. The Soul board. Charges Ban. Yeah, Soul Charges Ban. Regeki, Reasoning, this card is amazing. It's, I, I can see why. Since I play 1 through 12, call a level, they always call it wrong anyway, then just, you know, go plus. So you get your Fiendus. Oh my gosh. You're terraform because, you know, you want to get the best field card in the game right now, which is your three hidden city. This card's like $30 now, right? $30. I, yo, what? I picked these guys up when they were $5. I was like, okay. So plus. So plus. Okay. I play the spicy tech. Not everyone plays this, but I play this. What's that? I play three heat wave. I'll get back to this in a second, but this is what I play. So what it does is players cannot flip summon, normal summon, or special summon until your next draw play. I'll get back to this in a second, but this card. You're good. One, unfortunately, probably. There's supposed to be three of them, but. It's supposed to be like two proxies, but for now I do play two instant fusions. But when I do get two more pots, these two come out for the pots. Okay. I just realized you have a lot of traps too. Yeah, I'll pay time. All right, for the trap lineup, I play uh, sub terror final battle, the best no. trap card for sub terrors to date. I play three of them. Three of them tanks. The card that bends every one over. I played three. No linking that turn. Mm. What? You try to pen them summon. How much? Uh, you would have re thought. Response to your summon. Go ahead, put them all face down. And just in case that wasn't enough, I put another Death of Fear here with Quaking, put them face down, lock them. Right. And uh, Spicy Tech for traps. There can only be one. The best. The best. Since, since all my monsters are pretty much one of each different type with this card. 
So this doesn't affect it. They're all different types. So it, it just the, the synergy with this car is amazing. You only keep one on board anyway, so that it doesn't bother you. Be the warrior. A uh, spellcaster the game you do have it on board, and it was fair. Uh, secret village doesn't even hurt you. Oh, everything, everything. Ooh, 40 cards in the deck, bro? 45? I might cut it down to 42. If I take out, um, no, maybe 43 if I take out Mr. Poopy. Okay. All right. All right. We're going to come back to Heat Wave real quick. Yeah. Sorry, guys. We're on a time budget. That's why. Heat Wave. He goes, that was the combo. <laughs> the goo. All right. On your first turn, I go with Heat Wave. So pretty much we cannot summon. Flip summon, normal summon, or special summon until my next draw phase. But you can still set. I can still set. So mostly I'll set either the Guru face down. Activate Hidden City, uh, add whatever, say a Phoenix. I'm gonna activate Hidden City, which is flip face up a Subterra monster, not flip summon. So I flip face up a Guru to add a Subterra card. This is not flip summon, I get around, oh. I get around the heat wave. The same goes for the uh, Hidden City final, uh, Subterra final battle. It's the same, same effect as Hidden City with a flip face up. Uh, uh, you confirm up. that? Yeah. Oh, it has the same flip yeah. summon on it, so it gets over it. Oh. Ah. This also gets over skill drain as well. If you go activate Subterra card effects and not be negated, it gets over skill drain. So if you go skill drain, you look at them like, uh, okay, pay a thousand life points, activate. Ah, uh, uh, so be nasty, because I play skill and then I'll proceed to, you know. I was always tributing him. <laughs> <laughs> proceed to shenanigans. <laughs> so that's the profile for the tutorials. All right. So 45, uh, you're dropping to 42, though, right? Drop down 42. Uh, for the improvement, I would probably drop Quaking for either uh, Forbidden Chalice or Impermanent, so you got the minus spin on it. And dropping the Insufusions to so pick up two more part of the uh, Extravagance. Since I rarely go into the extra deck, which may like once, and either then, and then you might go for. Uh, that's your extra deck? Yep, these are my three targets for the Insufusions. And even then, I only go into him that one you time. You barely go into extra deck, though, right? Rarely. 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 So the pot doesn't really uh, affect me that much. For uh, for my extra deck, I play Abyss Solar. It gets a uh, Burning Abyss matchup. You play this. Uh, pendulums, Utopia, just to have it in there. The Link Rebo for uh, Fiendus, which is pretty good. The standard, this, this, is, this is supposed to be uh, Unicorn, but I stay with the Griffin for now. I play the two. It makes sense, yeah. And to, I don't go into any of this besides. So extravagance doesn't even really yeah, affect like that. Extravagance really doesn't affect the deck that much. But these are the main three guys out of the whole extra deck I go into. And that's rarely I go into. Wow, that's crazy. So all this is like extra fodder for extravagance. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. For uh, my side deck. You're still working on that, I see, right? Yeah. Oh, no, it's almost oh, oh, oh. Playing her order. Okay, we already know why. Yep. Uh, prank kids and uh, uh, ultra guys. It's supposed to be three. Uh, three uh, numbers. Damn. Damn. Okay, maybe I won't play you. <laughs> I got way too much. Yeah, you tribute. Also, I'm not so giving you So this is for the Sky Striker matchup. You guys do give him some shit. So, doesn't matter what you give him, since you're playing Subterra, I beat over everything you have that. Like, you can even give him this, it doesn't matter. It's whatever it is, you probably book it, banish it, or... Makes sense. Yeah. This is more for, like, rogues. Uh, if you're playing like, a deck that has multiple, multiple attributes, hit him with this. Maybe go back real heavy, hit him with this. And scroll, scroll heavy. I already know. Yeah. So that's the... Right. Alright, Jack, I appreciate the deck profile. Um, you're gonna try it this Thursday for the tournament, you said, right? I am trying it for this, uh, this Thursday for the tournament. I'll come back to you on that. Because first place is in the pot of extravagance. So I'm always down for trying to win another one. Because when the pot is real. Oh, my God, Bobby. Ah, uh, all right. Well, 
I bought three boxes, only for one, and that's my one. So, if any chance I can play for one, I'm down for one. All right, I gotta get that, an update on the record. I'll give you guys the, the score on how I did on the first tournament coming this week. So, uh, all right. All right, so Jackson, thank you again. I really appreciate it. Guys, there you go. That was Jackson Subterras. Thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in, and we all hope to see you in the next video. Later.